these are the X Real AR glasses. In this video, I'm gonna do a little bit of reviewing about what this product is, what I like about it, maybe things that they could do better, and whether I think it's something that people should invest in in the future. Hey, it's your man Ken Nova Neoji, founder of Nova Code Academy and Wazzle AI. And I know what you're thinking. You're going, Nova, you really just rocking the stunner shades like that? Dang, you looking real fly in them. I know you thinking that right now. But these are not just sunglasses. These are actually the new AR augmented reality sunglasses called the X Real. And what you don't know is that right now, as I'm looking at this camera, there is a clear HD screen projected forward that I can see perfectly fine and it's mirroring my laptop. Isn't that incredible? In this video, I'm gonna do a little bit of reviewing about what this product is, what I like about it, maybe things that they could do better, and whether I think it's something that people should invest in in the future. Let's go ahead and get into it. As I mentioned, these are the X Real AR glasses, and I believe they came out somewhere around last year. I really started seeing reviews about them come out last year. I think before that they were called the N Reels, but now they, they rebranded to be called the X Reels. Look, what they are is a replacement of a physical monitor. The backstory of the reason why I purchased this is that it has been on my radar for some time to want to invest and get it. However, one of the times during this week, I was programming away late at night. Out of nowhere, I woke up and looked at my screen and I saw that it was cracked. Not sure what I did to it. Maybe I elbowed it, who knows? It literally did not make any sense how my screen got cracked. But I remember thinking this is not the time for that. So I was thinking about ways that I can fix up the situation. Now, after a little bit of critical thinking about what I needed, instead of having to wait for you know somebody to repair the screen which sometimes could take hours what i ended up doing was and also of course it costs some money what i ended up doing was i purchased a hdmi adapter that works with this laptop so i can plug it in onto my monitor that fixed up the problem in the interim however i still was running into the issue of what should i do for times where I am not in front of my monitor. And I just thought it was a great opportunity to go ahead and check them out. And it works out exactly how I wanted it to. I mean, I got these and just literally plugged it in into the laptop. And from there, you see a mirror of the actual laptop being projected beautifully in front of your face. When I move around, that monitor is still right there. It is large. It's pretty much like if you're sitting on a couch, the distance, it's a proper distance away, but also it still makes everything very easily visible. Of course, some of the benefits here are, you know, you have something that's dynamic, something that's unique. Some of the things that people are highlighting is that it makes it so that your laptop or whatever you're doing is completely not visible to anybody else. That's one of the, the benefits of it. The other benefit was, let's just say, for example, I was doing sit-ups, watching John Wick 4 in HD with some, 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 some good headphones on that cancel out noise. I might as well have been in a movie theater for real while I'm doing sit-ups and watching John Wick 4 in HD. I mean, the experience is just really, really cool. One of the things that I was very much so looking forward to experimenting with is actually I have a, a app that I use for meditation. It's called Mesmerize. What it does is it's environments that are soothing, mixed with psychedelic, right? And you're experiencing, experiencing them in like hyper HD. And then on top of that, the noise, you know, the, medita the guided meditation is also very smooth. So 
experiencing that together, being in this immersive environment. And before, while using it, you're having to look at it like with your phone, you know, just looking at it like this. All right, that's cool. Now, having the ability to be immersed in that environment, it's unlike any other experience. These are some of the things that are the use cases for it, but it goes on more and more. I'm gonna tell you this, everybody knows that I make music as well. And I was wearing these as I spit my raps and I'm able to project the lyrics for my song onto the screen while I record my music. No longer do I need to hold the phone and then rap it. And then of course, you know, sometimes you stumble and you're like, man, you gotta scroll. No, instead now I have a monitor that I could project the lyrics of my song onto while I'm performing. And I gotta admit, it made for a smoother recording process. I mean, the things are sounding icy, <laughs> you know what I mean? So pretty much, man, don't let anybody tell you otherwise. Nova is the first rapper to use AR glasses while I'm rapping, while I'm performing, all right? Don't let anybody else tell you otherwise, all right? <laughs> But look, yeah, man, these are some really cool and innovative products for people that think outside of the box. This may be for you. You may be, you know, okay with, you know, your setup or whatever with some people like to have multiple different monitors, you know, that for their setup. For me, typically, I'm usually only using one. Sometimes I use, I think most times I'm using one. So, you know, having these is, is it's doing its job, it's doing its role really well. So this is a case that they, they come in, they come in this little pill, large pill sized case, and you can carry this around. And then from there, just literally just pop that into the laptop. Hopefully you don't you know, crack your screen like I did. And if you do, you could still go ahead and pick these up. They are a suitable replacement. I think there are on they definitely are on the Amazon store. That's where I purchased mine. They are under $400. They come with different adapters that you may need or you may not need. The one that you will need for your iPhone is the they have a adapter that looks like Yeah, they have a, an adapter that you use for connecting your iPhone to the to the glasses you will need that and you also will need to purchase a adapter that connects not just this box that's an interim that's a that is an, an adapter for the glasses but you'll also need a adapter that is sold by Apple that has an HDMI to the USB that the iPhones have. Now, of course, with the iPhone 15, they just real they just released the iPhone 15s that have the USB-C. So you can literally plug these directly into your iPhone on the iPhone 15 and most likely everything upwards of that. And yes, this is a bit of a, you know, my style of review. I know for a lot of other reviewers, they have the, you know, the specs, you know, and they have the, they have some other little gits and gadgets, but I really thought I would go ahead and wear these. While I'm performing this whole video, I can look at the camera, I see the camera. However, at the same time, I'm also seeing what is going on on my laptop. I can be programming right now opening up my IDE while I'm having this conversation with you and still be able to see my monitor, pull up a YouTube video, anything like that. So this is a very, very interesting product. You know, I had been waiting for some time to get them and this has been my first week with it. Some people ask, you know, what are the, the drawbacks? There are some adapters that they have that I wish you didn't need. They have an adapter called the B Reels and that is used for people that want to connect the device to, you know, let's say a game console directly to a game console, or they have other different types of devices that people may need a, I think largely for gaming that you may use this adapter for. I really think that they could have woven in 
the, you know, some of the things that they do with this adapter, they could have made that more lightweight and added that functionality from a software perspective and loaded it onto the classes because the adapter itself, they programmed it to have its own interface and its own functionality and be its own little thing. I think that that was overboard and it does cost a bit of money too. It's not a cheap little thing. It's cost over a hundred dollars. So, and I think that that really ideally wouldn't be needed. I just purchased it. I, I think that it might be a little bit unneeded. That is just one of the things about it. But as far as these themselves go, this device, I've been getting a lot of compliments about the way I look wearing them. I also like, you know, the different utility that I've experienced with it. So I really like them, you know, plain and simple. Thank you for watching this video. It's a bit of a review of the X Real AR glasses. You know, your man Nova, he's one of the first rappers slash software engineers slash, you know, all of that, that, you know, was rocking them. So had to, you know, do a bit of a review about that. So, <laughs> hey man, I appreciate y'all watching the video. Oh yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you for all the, all the people that subscribe to the channel. Catch y'all later, right?